guys, Phil of Bedford here. Welcome to the Rebel Networker. And today I'm with the uh, father of modern networking, Dr. Ivan Meisner. Ivan, welcome back to the show. Thanks, Phil. It's great to be on the show. I've been on a few times now. You have now. <laughs> and you'll be on more if I get my way. All right, absolutely. Awesome. <laughs> now, what not a lot of people don't know is uh, b and is actually 31 years. 31 years old. 31 yeah. years old. And as a business, what a lot of people don't realize is they've grown every single day year yeah now, I don't know many businesses that have done that you know I, I don't know of any businesses that have 31 years of consecutive growth without exception recession no recession 31 years it's been amazing mm. what, what would be your uh, one tip would you think that for, for companies that are uh, starting to stagnate well you know I think I, I think it's about being a dog with a bone to a certain extent you have got to have a plan a system of process and then work it, work it, work it. It's about doing six things a thousand times, not a thousand things six times. And I see people, that they'll go off and try this and they'll go off and try that. Even though they've had some success, mm. then maybe they'll try something else. Uh, or, worse yet, when I've seen a lot of businesses when they start to become successful, just start to kind of, you know, hey, how things going? This is pretty good. Why don't we go out and play some golf today? And, uh, you know, they just start taking for granted the business and they don't continue to work the business and do the things that made them successful to begin with they kind of lay back once that starts to happen happen business starts to go down interesting I've actually got some clients and uh, I've noticed in the past they, they, they'll come and coach they'll uh, follow a process they'll start to get successful and they'll start to get busy yeah and then they'll disengage with coaching yes what would be your tips be to those people stop that <laughs> Stop that. You know, you've got to be constantly building the business, and it's so easy to get caught up uh, in uh, analysis paralysis, to get caught up in um, the administrative aspects of a business, because as a business grows, there's a lot of administration that has to happen. I think an entrepreneur is either working in their flame or working in their wax. And when they're in their flame, they're on fire, they're excited about what they're doing. When they're in their wax, it just sucks them dry. What happens, I think, is that businesses get caught up in that wax. Mm -hmm. And they're like, well, I, don't, I, can't, I can't afford to hire this accountant or you know, legal is expensive. And so they try to do some of it themselves. I, I'm guilty of that. I did some of that myself mm -hmm. until I realized, you know what? It's better to have someone else handle that admin work and free me up to go out and sell, to go out and build the business. So once you stop building the business, uh, it starts to decline. Brilliant. Great tips there. So, Ivan, thanks for the show. Yeah, you thanks bet. for coming on the show again. Yeah, my pleasure. We'll be seeing you soon.